thumbs up for Greg being a fucking badass in this chapter. How's it going, guys? It's Tay Salamana here, and I'm gonna get my thoughts and opinions on Fairy Tale Chapter 306. Pretty much the chapter starts off with, you know, Grey versus Rufus, rematch number two, and see how the outcome is gonna come in that battle and everything. And pretty much he has a little flashback, Grey does, about when Mavis is telling Fairy Tale on the uh, calculations on how each battle will go out and everything. And pretty much Mavis talks about the uh, fight with Rufus. And once Grey hears that, he pretty much nominated himself, saying, pretty much, please, as a member of Fairy Tale, let me fight him. Please, I'm begging you. So pretty much, Mavis is a little worried about it, but at the same time, she believes in her uh, team, so she pretty much gives the okay to Grey to let let him fight Rufus. So pretty much afterwards, was you know, go back to the fight and everything, and pretty much Grey is going all out against Rufus. So like, he's attacking him with ice lances, like, ice, big-ass hammers and everything, and pretty much Rufus is just, like, dodging this shit like it's nothing to him. So pretty much he's saying pretty much that... I'm memorizing all your techniques and everything, and this gets a great little puzzle saying, what do you mean exactly? He said pretty much, he said pretty much, I'm memorizing all your ice techniques, and also, I memorized my, also, my teammate as well, Orga's Black Lightning, so pretty much, I could combine them both together and create a new, a new, uh, you know, magic technique. And so next page we see, we see Rufus combine Gray's magic and Orga's Black Lightning and create Sword of the black sort of the freezing black lightning if I'm not too mistaken and pretty much he hits Grey with that technique and everything it hits him and pretty much afterwards Rufus used one of his techniques and create this like little storm gust storm gust magic all over and that's hitting pretty much hitting Grey left and right here and there and pretty much afterwards the audience is the audience is wondering like is Grey gonna actually win and next afterwards we see, you know, Grey strip off his, you know, strip off his freaking coat like he do in every manga chapter and in every anime series. He takes off his fucking clothes, <laughs> which is ridiculous. And pretty much saying, pretty much saying afterwards that ever since I had this fairy tale Gilmark put on me, I've never lost to the same opponent twice. And so pretty much, you know, he gives his little speech, emotion speech and everything. And he gets all frustrated. And pretty much afterwards... He does his uh, signature pose, and he says, Ice Maker, and that's this going on. Rufus is about to try to, you know, memorize it. And pretty much Gray uses a, I think maybe this is a new technique, if I'm not too mistaken, but he uses Ice Magic Unlimited. And pretty much afterwards, as this happens, Rufus gets a little shocked. And next panel we see is, you know, Gray with his ice swords, like, squirt, like a swirl all around it, like his swords all around and everything and this pretty much gets Rufus like a little confused and everything he's saying what's going on what's going on exactly like why can't I memorize this like this is crazy pretty much afterwards you know Gray goes on to say pretty much you can't memorize this technique because it's my power of emotions that's driving me to do this and so pretty much as this happens Ru Rufus says pretty much that I can count this. T he can count this magic with using some uh, memorized flames that he, you know, memorized. And so pretty much, he hits Gray with his fire uh, technique, and it surrounds Gray in the fire. And pretty much, Gray says with an epic speech that pretty much, I've memorized stronger flames. And I'm so I'm assuming that's gotta be from Natsu. So pretty much, next panel we see, he attacks Rufus, you know, with ice magic, unlimited sword thousand t technique it hits hit Rufus straight on and pretty much afterwards we see you know Rufus he's like in pain with all the ice in him and everything and pretty much he falls to the ground and then at the end of that we see that Gray is the victor and he puts on <laughs> Rufus's hat and that's where pretty much the chapter ends overall I have to say pretty much this was a very badass chapter I have to give it to Gray on this one like he's truly showing us that he truly is a badass like not as bad as it's Urza, but maybe right under there with Natsu and Urza, like right under them. But he did good, though. That's what's up. I feel it on this chapter, though. It's been a while since I've seen this epic since Urza fought against the, you know, the hundred monsters. But thumbs up to Gray. He did his fucking best. I still don't can tell if he actually uh, some of these new techniques he used was it the help of his um his second origin container or not. I still don't know if he used it or not, but. I think he did because he, he was showing off his uh, strength and everything. So, like I said, 
great for the motherfucking win. But pretty much, I hope to see more from Fairy Tale. And next week, mm, we might probably shift over back over to not to his group, but I'm probably hoping more if we see either um, Urza versus Kagura or Ur Urza versus Minerva or something, or even better, freaking Loxus versus Orga, because I want to see the fucking two black. I want to see the uh, two go at each other. Black Lightning versus Lightning Dragon Slayer. That'll be epic. Pretty much, let me know what you thought of the chapter. Was it good? Was it bad? Did you like it? Was it on par or anything? Also, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Give it a video response. And pretty much, rate, comment, subscribe. And have a blessed day.